Polybind. Polybind Stone Dust is a unique mixture of polymer binders and calibrated stone. Once set, it will still retain flexibility and provide a long-lasting, durable jointing material. Polybind Polymeric Stone Dust. Extra bonding. Extra strength. Extra durability. Product works at above 59 Fahrenheit, 15 Celsius, fast setting, minimum 24 hours without rain, compatible with all types of wet cast and natural stones, for joints that are a minimum of half an inch, 1.25 centimeters, to a maximum of 6 inch, 15 centimeters wide, does not haze stones, for pedestrian use only, and covered with a 15 year limited warranty. Polybine Stone Dust is recommended for a variety of uses, walkways and pool decks, including patios, and are offered in tan and gray. Polybine stone dust could also be used with a gator base foundation. Cover the foundation and side with a gator fabric GF 4.4. Lay and compact three quarter of an inch of sand down to half an inch. Lay the gator base. Lay a level one inch of loose bedding sand. Traditional way. Cover the foundation and side with a Gator Fabric GF 4.4. Fill and compact the excavated area with 6 inches minimum of crushed stone. One Gator Base replaces a whopping 6 inches of compacted crushed stone. Gator Base make you save excavation and labor. What a saving! Lay and level 1 inch of loose bedding sand. We are now ready to lay the stone and fill the joints with polybine stone dust. When installed, Wet cast and natural stone sides and top surfaces must be completely dry. Polybine stone dust can only be installed above 59 degrees Fahrenheit, 15 Celsius, and no rain forecasted in the next 24 hours. Do not use when the stones are installed over a concrete base. Installation steps. Step one, stones installations. Install the stones on a maximum one inch bed of sand. Step two. Polybine Stone Dust Installation. Using a hard bristle broom, sweep it in between the full depth of the natural stone joints. Step three, compaction and consolidation of the polybine stone dust. Hit the stones with a rubber mallet. This will make the dust. Settle firmly into the joints by removing any air pockets. Repeat step two and three at least twice. Sweep off excess polybine stone dust. Using a soft bristle broom, sweep all excess off stone surfaces. Ensure it lies at least 1 8 of an inch, 3 millimeters below the top of the stones. Step 5. Blowing off excess polybine stone dust residue. Using a leaf blower, blow all residues off stone surfaces. Step 6. Watering activation process. Shower water on a specific water area 50 square feet, 5 square meters, for 90 seconds. Stop showering when you see water retention on the stone's joints. Repeat the directions for all other areas that have not been showered with water. Step 7. Blowing off excess water and polybine stone dust. This blowing action is necessary to help remove any remaining residue on the stone surfaces from the previous steps. Polybine Stone Dust. Extra bonding. Extra strength. Extra durability. To learn more, visit us at polybine.com.